Yeah, buddy. It's all right. Oh, hello. Oh, I've had one bass and one pup so far, so caught on rag. So, yeah, that's what the state of the play is at the moment. Been fishing since seven o'clock. Well, I've been playing because I've got my dog with me today, so. Yeah, I've had one, one little smooth hound. One little smooth hound, so uh, I've got a little picture of him as well. So, <coughs> yeah. oh, good get it, boy. But uh, I've not long just put the smooth hound back, so um, you'd have to excuse me if you hear my dog bark because I've actually got me, me uh, little Jack Russell with me today. So, <coughs> just warning people off to stay clear, he protects me like that. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> That's my dog. Absolutely hates it if someone comes anywhere near me. <laughs> Goes off his rocker. But uh, my tripod torch isn't uh, fully charged up, so um, you're going to have to bear with that as well. Uh, I forgot to put it on charge, I didn't realise it was flat as a pancake. So it'll be on low setting tonight just to try and cons cons conserve as much battery power as I can in it. Uh, but no, I'm just using two hook flapper and a pulley panel just to uh, see what's out there I suppose. Right buddy. Hey. But yeah, yeah, I'll show you my little dog. Or our little dog, shall I say. There he is. Russell, come here. <laughs> That's our little Jack Russell. Come here, buddy. Come here, come on. Yeah. <laughs> He's still a little puppy, but you know what I mean? Thought I'd bring him with me tonight, so leave him alone. They're not going to hurt you. All right, back to fishing, guys. There we go. I'm not going to hurt you. Sit down, alright? They're over there fishing as well, alright? Don't worry about them. <coughs> uh. Alright, buddy? Okay. Oh. But no, as I say, I've had two fish so far. Which is one bass and one, one small pup. So hopefully we'll get a few more. You never know, do you? At least I haven't blanked tonight. Alright, buddy. Alright, come on. I might switch over to a bit of peeler in a minute, especially if the hounds are around later on. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Come on, you, you silly sausage. Go touch your stone. Go sniff it out, boy. Come on. But no, it's a. Uh... 
see what happens at the end of the day now, innit? And see what happens. But I'll stick out a bit of peeler later on. Hopefully we'll have a nice sized hound, you never know. Or a nice sized bass. I know I'm near uh, I'm near Gil, Gil Kicker in Gosport if any of you know where that is. Um, I've got Gil Kicker to my left and I've got Lifeboat Lifeboat Station, Gosport Lifeboat Station to my right. So I'm sort of like near enough in the middle. I was gonna go to Has I was gonna go to Hasler Wall. That was where I was gonna head. But then I decided, you know, then I was, you know, we decided to uh, bring the dog with us tonight. So um, decided to come here so you can have a roam around on the beach as well. Because it was on Hasler Wall, you ain't got much to uh, walk around and sniff on. So. Cheers, Paul. What's that ball? What's the ball? Look at the ball. Get the ball. No, that's a stonesy muppet. You won't dig that out, that's your steak. You watch this, I'll go live, you know, I've gone live now and I won't catch anything now. <laughs> yeah, but it's Sod's Law. <laughs> well, high tide's around about half eleven midnight, so... I shall stream until my batteries go flat. I've got two little small battery packs with me, so... We'll see how long it takes for them to go flat. <coughs> Where's your ball, mate? Don't get your ball. You want to sniff the stones out, yeah? With my scent on. Okay, we can do that. We can handle that. A couple of guys fishing to my uh, left. They've not had anything yet since they've been here. Pretty much been here, been here about the same time as me. And I've got a couple of other guys to my right of me, a couple hundred yards down the beach. And they're only just starting to set up, so. Who else is streaming? Does anyone know? And have they caught anything yet? Come on, get this one. <laughs> Stones, mate. Get your ball instead. Go on, get your ball. Yeah, okay. That's Facebook playing up for you.
I was going to say that's Facebook for you, isn't it? <coughs> My Facebook's been playing up all day. Has Lee had anything yet that you know, Steve? Windy dindy dindy. Uh, I've had that one bass, Steve, and I've had a just before I come on, just before I come on live, I had a, I had a nice little uh, hound, nice little, you know, nice little pup. They yeah, caught them. <laughs> Both of them fish caught on rag. Yeah, I know Lee's live. Didn't know if he's caught anything yet. It's always nice to know if uh, any of the other streamers that are streaming uh, caught anything. It's a stone buddy. Yeah, that's what it is. It's a bit of... <laughs> I'll have to bring the rag one in in a minute and uh... <laughs> he couldn't buy a bite. Uh, I'd like to have watched it but I was I was really tired yes, uh, yes, yesterday. That's why I had to be caught anything because you, you know if you caught anything I'd stick it on YouTube. No worries Steve. We've got Pete. How's it going, mate? <laughs> Come on, get your ball, mate. Daddy got your ball. <laughs> well, go back. No, you're not interested in that, are you? Not interested in the football. Oh, all right, Dad. Oh. I wouldn't say it's blowy. <laughs> Not the slightest one bit, to be honest. The wind's probably, what, about seven mile an hour, if that. It's really, really dropped right down, so um, you never know. Could be a little ray out there, or a little form back ray. I've got ray baits with me. Also got peter crab with me, and obviously the other rod's on rag, so... We'll just see what happens, you know, because all we can do is stick the baits out and go from there. But no, it's not blowy at all, mate. As you know, these uh, fishing umbrellas, the slightest bit of breeze, and it starts flapping away like nobody's business. I'm going to have to get my head torch out because I'm going to find it difficult to, um, <coughs> to see. I've already had a bass, Craig. I've already had one of them so far, so. I'm happy with a, with a bass. And I've had a hound tonight already, so. See if we can try and pull out a hat. Oh, he's not, well, not a hat trick. See if we can try and pull out a. Um, yeah, Western Shore, I think he is. I've fished it many a times. Used to be good for flounders there, babe. Many, 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 many moons ago. That's where me and my dad used to go fishing. Right, Gary, chewy. <coughs> when are you going swimming then, Gary? <laughs> Got your ball now, mate. Ready to swim.
Oh, he's blanking at the moment, is he? Oh well. I'm sure. I'm sure it'll pick up around about high tide. <laughs> Normally does on Western Shore. Nah, Gary. I don't forget things like that, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I thought my rod was going to go for a swim earlier on. Big lump of weed caught on it. But I managed to save it anyway. No, it's not food, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, right. Yeah, I know. It. I, I, I know he had his missus. Missus with him or something. Yes, I have got company, Gary. <coughs> yeah, I'll show you. Ready? Yeah, there he is. Russell, come here. Yeah, there's our dog. <laughs> <laughs> Come back here. Come on. Shut up, you, you muppet. <laughs> I'll have more fun with the dog than I will fishing. <laughs> right, back to fishing then, guys, eh? You're the second person to say it's windy here, it's not, not at all. <laughs> now, now. No. Good boy. Have you heard of any pattern? No. We probably won't get pattern now until the winter, so. Yeah, cheers Mike. He's a lovely, you know, he's a lovely little Jack Russell. Wouldn't, wouldn't be without him. Good, good little, good, good little angle bite, a guard dog, I'll tell ya. Absolutely fantastic. Anyone that's anyone that's come anywhere near me tonight, he's gone for them. Put it that way. They've stayed clear. They've they they sort of like veered, probably about a mile away. <laughs> I hates it when anyone comes anywhere near me. The wind's only seven mile an hour, Tony. So 
hardly no wind at all. It's just a little tiny gentle breeze. Well, I'm going to have to change this rag. I'll be back in a minute. Silly sod. Come here. <laughs> all right, I'm not going anywhere, all right? You're still here. Stop panicking. <laughs> yeah, you silly sausage, didn't you? Yeah, I know. I know. I know, yes. Go on and get down. As you can see, my dog don't like me walking away. <laughs> he is a right little sidekick with me, I'll tell you. Don't like being, being two foot away from me. <laughs> Always wants to be constantly sat beside me or on me, you know. It's... And not only that, it's his first little fishing trip, so... It's the first time I've actually brought him. So it's all new to him, so I've got to give him the benefit of the doubt, and I. <laughs> now nah, there's no target species tonight. <coughs> Just to pick some baits out and see what happens. Just having a look, see what's around. I know, buddy. I know. Yeah. Good, good boy. Come on. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, ah, that's my ear you're chewing, boy. Mm. Yeah. Come on. But no, as I say, it's his first little trip out, so... In it, bud. Yeah, I know. 
They're only fishing, they're not doing anything, all right? <laughs> oh, he's already smelt a, a little, um, a little, uh, smooth out, Steve. <laughs> He's sniffing all over it, he was. <laughs> That's a good boy. Here you go. Here's your boy, boy. Yeah. Sniffing it, licking it. <laughs> yeah, nah, bless him. He keeps watching the other guys down here fishing. He can see the, you know, he can see the, you can see the tip lights in there. Dark shadows, and he's and he's like, <laughs> I say it's all new to him. It's his first little fishing adventure. <laughs> hopefully, I'll be, I know. Hopefully, I'll be bringing him on some more. <sighs> you still see my rods, okay? Yeah, because <laughs> I'm trying to save his. I'm trying to save. <laughs> I'm trying to save as much battery power as I can in that um, in my tripod torch because it's not even half charged. So you'd have to bear with me tonight. <laughs> oh bless Mike yeah this one's you know this one's still a little pup you know he's, 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 he's not even one and a half years old yet so he's still learning he's still learning if I can bring him on as many many uh Fishing trips as I can, here we know, we'll start getting used to it, and then I've let him off a lead once, well, a couple of times, but then he sort of like wanders off a little bit, he gets a little bit sidetracked, so I've actually got him on a, on a bit of a long lead at the moment, so he can still walk around everywhere. Right, I'm going to have to go and bring the other rod in because that bait's been out there uh, probably about 45 minutes. So probably bait's gone. So I should be back in a minute. I'm going to get the old bait changed over. I'm going to put a peeler out and um, see what happens on that. So I'll be back in a minute. Thank <laughs> you. 
anything, mate. Right? Come here, come on. Still see my fishing rods okay, can't you guys? Just want to make sure you can still see my rods okay. Fish on! Here you go guys. Yeah, only a tiny little pup, but you know what I mean? Yeah. Buddy, what was the time live on that? 37 minutes. Say 37. I think I've got a bit of weed on the other one because it's pulling over.
They're not gonna get you, mate, all right? They're over there fishing. They're not gonna come over here. <laughs> all right, back in a minute. Cast this one out. Oh, funny thing, I'm going to have to bring the other rod in in a minute. I think there's a bit of weed on there. And that weed's pulling it. Alright buddy, come on. Come and sit down here, come on. Yeah, I think I've got a bit of weed on that on on that other rod. God. Yes, mate. Two staries and a bass so far. So, uh, yeah, we are catching. They're not gonna bite you, all right? Leave them alone. They're fishing as well, all right? All right, Colin. How's it going, mate? <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> I don't know if you'll see him, but I'll swing it round. There's Russell. And I'm going to have to pull this, well, this uh, rod in because there's a lot of weed on it, I think. So I'm going to have to pull it in. I'll be back in a minute.
tell him, bud. Come here. I'm not going anywhere. Why? Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> That's my dog. <laughs> oh, I, I thought there was a bit of lumber weed on that. <laughs> Oh, that camera looks absolutely rubbish, doesn't it? Hang on, two sets. I think the camera needs cleaning. <sighs> but no, for uh, some of you that are watching now, I've had uh, one bass and two starry hounds so far. Um, pulling in a little bit of weed, so I'm gonna ease, 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 ease up down to one rod for the moment. Because I don't want to knock my back out. So, um, the white tips out, so we'll keep to that one for the moment. Wait if this weed eases off a little bit. Then I'll whack the other one back out again. <laughs> nice one, Colin. <laughs> Only small ones, Mark. Thirty six minutes into the stream you'll see the first one. But as you know, you know, my back is playing up a little bit. So um if I pulled in that much weed then I'm gonna stick to one rod. As I say I don't wanna really knack on my knack on my back out at the moment, so Otherwise, I'm going to be back to square one again. And I really don't want that happening. So, we'll see how things go in about half hour. And then we'll go from there. And I thought there was another peeler in this, but there isn't. <laughs> I've just got a crab legs with me now. But I've got a couple of soft crabs with me, so um, we'll stick the old softies out with these peeler claws. But other than that, we got Ray Bates with us tonight as well. We got a bit of mackerel. Got some bluey.
Right, buddy. So, um, yeah, there you go, eh? Anyway, let's get this rag changed because it's been out there more than 15 minutes, so, um, yeah. Tell me a bit of seaweed, eh? Come on. A bit of seaweed ain't gonna hurt you either, eh? Now I'm just gonna be sad. What bird? <coughs> you doing a run in commentary again? Okay. Oh, what's going on there? Thank <laughs> you. 
until he's sold. Come on. Right, there we go. <laughs> you talking to the rag again, buddy? Hey? Okay, come on. Come here then. Get here. Yeah, there was a lot of rag. Come on, Phil. There's a lot of weed coming in at the moment, so I've dropped down to one rod. Keep an eye on the white tip rod. Because um, that's out on rag at the moment on a two at clip down flapper. So I can get some distance so that the rag don't spin cut and split up into two and three and fours so um, once the weed dies down a little bit I'll see how it goes and then I'll stick out the other rod if not then it will just be the one rod Alright, so because uh, I don't want to knock on my back out. Otherwise, I'm going to be back to square one again. Up, Paul. Looks like there's weed again on that. Oh. Looks like it's going to be a weedy night. But you never know. I've had three out so far, so all good. Got tides pulling to the right at the moment as well. By the looks of things. Yeah, one bass, two starries pull at the moment, so caught one on stream, the other two are uh, off stream. But I've got pictures of them anyway, so. So yeah, there you go. That's the state of play at the moment. I'm only fishing with one rod because there's too much weed pulling through at the moment, so I'm not breaking my back. Been tacked off again, Steve. Well, I never. <laughs> Yeah, I oh know. I think I think my camera needs a uh, cleaning. <laughs> Better than Phil's stream. <laughs> Why? What's going on? <laughs> I think I might have a bit of dirt on my lens or something. I you know. I don't, I, I don't know. I'll tell you what. I'll give it. A... I'm not moving, dog. Don't panic.
two sets guys I'm just going to clean the lens guys so uh, it's going to go a bit fuzzy from for a minute or two all right I'm going to see if that does anything better How's that? Yeah, it still looks a bit fuzzy, doesn't it? Yeah. Don't worry about it. I ain't. Oh, dog's laid right down now. I think dog's getting a bit tired. He's actually laying down. <laughs> it might be because I've got a low low light setting on on my tripod camera because I'm trying to save battery battery power in my tripod cam in you know, my tripod camera in my tripod light because um, I didn't realise it was flat as a pancake, so it's probably not even half charged. So I'm trying to save as much battery power in it as I can. <laughs> no, I'm not I'm not I'm not far away. Right buddy. Okay. Where's your ball ball? Right, you got your ball. Oh! Nah, it's just a bit of weed, guys. Alright, bud. Don't worry. Daddy's pulling in a lot of weed again. Alright, don't need to panic.
Don't gonna bring the rock right over here. Fast asleep, buddy. Come on then, come on. Ah, oh, you silly sod. Oh, I'm back guys. What have I missed? <laughs> hey buddy, come on. Sweet little blanket out, yeah? There you go, bud. <laughs> so guys, uh, is uh any uh, any other people caught anything yet on the other streams yet? still not catching yet. Not late. Fish, Dino. And weed. Bass and hounds. Only small ones. Oh, it's only me that's streaming now, is it? <laughs> Oh dear, what's going on then? Why aren't the others streaming? They've given up already, have they? I'm hoping this weed will die, I'll die down a little bit. But uh, we'll soon see, won't we?
Uh, say tide's pulling to the right at the moment, so uh, I'm picking up quite a bit of weed. So, hence the reason why I've gone down to one rod. Because I'm not busting my back. Pulling in two lots of weed, you know. It's, Yeah, let's hope I'll get another fish on, yeah? Keep your fingers crossed, you never know. You never know, do you? Ooh, look, ooh, look. It's part of my green shower. I think my dog's getting tired. Because he's curling up next to me right by my box <laughs> on his little blanket. Bless him. I thought he'd still be up running around, but he's not. He's tired. I think the sea air's got to him. <laughs> As I say, he's not, you know, it's only his first little fishing trip out with me, so he'll get used to it. Not your buddy. <sighs> oh. I know I had a little parcel come through today. I had my little uh, lazy salt, um, salt, I can't pronounce that bloody word. My lazy strap, mobile phone strap today. So, uh, I can have, I can have my phone now strapped to my chest. So I'm going to try that out soon. Try it out, see what happens with that as well. <sighs> nope, not yet, Mark. No, was a, I wasn't expecting it to turn up today. No, it's not a chess cam. It's called a lazy, uh, a lazy shoulder, shoulder strap. That's what it's called. Because if it was a chest cam, it'll be right up. You know, the the the, the phone will be right up close to the uh, to my chest, and I'm not going to be able to see anything. I'm not going to see any comments. But this thing I've got allows me to put my phone out about half a foot in front of me. 
so I can angle angle my phone so I can still see comments. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, but it's slow, isn't it? No, nope, it's not a strap on selfie stick either. <laughs> But it's only me. Wow, but it's pointing out my face, you don't need to tune in, then, do you, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> Pointed to my face, especially when you tune in, then yeah. <laughs> oh, so it looks like there's another big lump of weed on that, by the looks of things, the way it's pulling over. Buddy, you can't be cold. Come on. Not used to it, are you, mate? Eh? Come on. You'll get used to it, buddy. There you go. Tell my dog's not used to this because he's curled up right, right next to my box on his little blanket. <laughs> he's slowly going to sleep, bless him. Trying to keep warm. He's in my shower. Oh. Get that rag changed in a minute. No, nah, it's Facebook for you, babe. Nothing. Not missing much, put it that way. Russell's gone to sleep. I don't think he's used to it. <coughs> yeah, he's cut up next to my box. On his on his on his little blanket. 
he's not used to it. He's not. He's, he's not used to it, is he? He's, he? he's new to this, so not give him the benefit of the doubt. But he's fine. He's not cold anyway. Half sitting in the shower and half with his head out, so. Boy. Oh, get your time for yourself. <laughs> oh, like I say, you know, it's only his first, it's his first fishing trip, you know. It's, I'm hoping to take him on some more, you know, bring him with me some more as well. So he don't, you know, so he don't have to be stuck in every time I go fishing. I'll start taking him with me. Just want to get him used to, so I can uh, let him off a lead a little bit more. You know, I can't see him because I'll, I'll disturb all the camera and everything. Right, I'm gonna change this rag. <laughs> He's my dog. My dog gets spoiled. What my dog wants, he gets. <laughs> right, it's going to change his rag.
Come on. Come back over here, buddy. Come on. Oh, jeez. Midnight, high water. To be honest, I'm probably not going to stay stay that late. Hey, buddy, come on, get it. Because that's another big lump of weed I've just pulled in. Keep on pulling weed, then uh, I should just, I should just, I should just pack up and go home. Uh, one bass and two ounces, Dave. But yeah, I'm going to give it, give, give it another three casts and see how the weed goes. We'll see how the weed goes on, on, on the third cast from now. And if it's still bad, then I'm just going to pack up and go home because I'm not going to bust my back keep bringing in big lumps of weed like that you know what I mean that's why I've gone down to one rod I'm not busting my back pulling in two lots of weed like that <sighs> thought I might get Thought I might get a uh, couple, of, couple, of, couple of extra fish, but obviously not yet. Uh, bloody weed stinks. It's that oily, oily smell. Dave I say you know I was going to go to Hasler Wall but you know I decided to bring bring the dog for his first fishing trip so I thought I'd come down you know down where I am now so he can have a bit of a run around on the beach I was going to go into Brown Down but Brown Down's closed off. Yeah, we've got exercises going on in there, so that's bugging that idea up. So that's why I'm uh, where I am tonight. At least I've had a couple of fish out, you know. Let's not see if I can get a couple more out before I pack, decide to pack up and go home. Yeah, it's horrible. I'm not just bringing in little bits, I'm bringing in... You know what I mean? Full whack loads. I was say it's not doing my back any good. Put it that way. Well, it's, it's 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 not doing my sciatica any good. I 
should probably feel it in the morning and I'll be back to square one again. <laughs> Yeah, I know. At least I've caught, you know. Not the sizes I want, it's only small ones. <laughs> I was hoping for, you know, half decent size, but uh, never mind, eh? There's always another time. There's always more time. In there, Russ, eh? Loads of time. <laughs> oh, God, no. Of course it is. Oh dear. Jeez. Oh, Getting tired myself. <laughs> Thought I might have had a little bream earlier on coming over this side, but nah. Not even had a. I'm not. I'm not even had a bream this year yet. I checked my catches from last year, and this time last year I was raking it. I was bringing in bream like left, right, and centre. This year I've not had one. I reckon they're late. I reckon they're late, or someone else is catching them. Oh, that's nice to know. Be at Chazel in uh, two and a half weeks now, isn't it? Two and a half weeks. So hopefully I'll catch a couple of bream and bring a couple of bream. Bring home a couple of bream. Might even have a couple of bream down on the beach as well. <laughs> Get caught on little throw, throw throwaway barbies. I'll tell you what, Paul, I think you are right there. Most fish are late this year. I say this time, you know, this time last year, I I I I think I had about two carry bags full of mackerel. And I had loads, and I caught loads of bream. This year it just seems to be really, really slow. I blame the EU, you know. Yeah, I blame EU. It's their fault. <laughs> I 
But I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to end up packing this uh, one rod away in a minute. Well, we got a big blow coming up soon, haven't we? There's a hurricane coming over from the States at the moment. So I've been reading about it. It's bringing in thunderstorms, heavy rain. And big winds, apparently. It's supposed to be hitting in a couple of weeks, so... Hopefully not over Chesil. When we, we know when, when we actually hit Chesil. Have to keep an eye on that weather. Dave. Mm -hmm. Oh dear. Donald Trump says Theresa May will kill any trade deal for the US. That's just popped up on my phone. <laughs> oh well, never mind, eh? You bring up, bring up, uh, the weather for the next couple of weeks, you know, there's a, a, I'm on a, I'm on a Facebook site, I can't remember what it's called, it's, um, Storm, Storm something, I can't, can't remember exactly what it's called, but I say, you know, they've got a, they've got a hurricane over there, over there. Which is on its way, heading towards the UK, so hopefully it will swerve. And then head Scotland and uh, mess up Scotland, you know what I mean, Gary? <laughs> Scotland will get it, you know, it'll miss us down here. <laughs> <laughs> To be honest, I think, you know, to be honest, I think we do need a bit of a blow down here. and might stir up a few things. Oh, you know, you know what I mean, hopefully, a couple of days before we go to Chesil, a big wind will come along, we'll stir it all up, and then uh, Bob's your uncle. We'll have a cracking weekend. <laughs> but I think I'm going to pack this other rod up. So um, bear, bear me a couple of minutes while I pack this other rod up. I'm not going to chuck it back out again. <laughs> okay, well, Gary, you won't live it down, mate. <laughs> we won't give in until you until we actually see you in that water. <laughs> What's up, buddy? I'll just keep that hook away from a dog just in case he screams over this side. Hi, mate. Right, put your head down. There you go. Alright, is that Potter? Get that rag changed in a minute because it's been out there a bit longer than what I anticipated. Ow. Uh, 
Oh, pardon me. That's the wind beneath the wind. Oh, bud. Are you watching that light, are you, mate? Yeah. I think I'll start making some rigs up soon as well for Chazel, I think. I ain't even started on them yet. All right, Steve, no worries, mate. I'm probably not going to catch another fish now. You do, you do know that, don't you? <laughs> you ain't going to miss much. To be honest. Oh, let's get this rag changed. Back in a minute.
Oh, Gary, you off, are you? Thought I could smell something. <laughs> you know, I'm only joking. Hmm? Oh, I need my light on because I can't see anything, can I? Switch the brain. Look, right, buddy. Still walking around, yeah? Good boy. Oh, come on. There's a knife, that's what I wanted. That's what I was looking for. Sniff this, do ya? Come on. Hey. Well, let's just see what happens now, shall we? Oh, that's a big surge of water coming in. Oh God, I've got a big lump of seaweed on that again. Nope. Come here, buddy.
Yeah, there's like a lump of seaweed again. Yeah, I ain't going to be too long now, babe, anyway. I'm probably going to have one more cast after this, because if, if I pull in another lump of, lump, lump of weed, I'll just have one more cast, and then I shall be packing up and then coming home. Because I'm not going to sit here breaking my back, pulling in lots of weed. So I probably ain't going to be too long. I'll probably end up saving on my peeler. But to me, it looks like a lump of seaweed on that again, so... If it is, it'll be one more cast for me, and then that'll be it. Alright Paul, no worries mate. That looks like a lump of seaweed to me. A big lump of seaweed. I ain't gonna be too long now, babe, anyway, so.
Yes, Ricky. Two bass and two, uh, one bass and two ounce. And a load of seaweed. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Yeah. Well, let's go and bring this one in. Sorry. Right, guys. Um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna call it there. I'm bringing in too much weed. Um, the weeds are absolutely horrendous. Wow, well, you can probably see it on the uh, top of my rod bending. So no, no, I'm not I'm not gonna do that again. 
I'll end up busting my back. And I don't want to bust my back up. So I'm gonna call it I'm gonna call it quits there. And I'm gonna pack up and then I'm gonna go home. Cause I'm not pulling in that much weed again. Alright buddy. We're going home now, alright? So don't panic. Alright, Daddy's just got a pack up. Okay. Alright. Once Daddy's packed up, then we can go. Alright. No worries. You know, you know, I'm not I'm not gonna keep busting my back. Wouldn't be wouldn't be so bad if you know if it was a nice nice heavy fish, but no, it's just weed, and I'm not gonna keep pulling in weed like that because that is really really bad. <laughs> and yeah, that's it. I've, I've, I'm gonna I'm gonna you know as I say, I'm just gonna call it quits there and um, pack up and go home. But anyway, guys. Oh, Russell says night as well. <laughs> and obviously I've had two bass oh, no. what do I keep saying two bass for I've not had two bass I've had one bass I've had one bass and two ounce obviously I'll put a picture of that up later on when I go you know when I get home just so you can all see that. Um, but yeah, other than that, that's it. That's all we've got for tonight, unfortunately. I was hoping for a little bit more, but obviously we didn't get any, didn't get anything else. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna stop the stream there now and pack up this last little bit. And then I'm gonna get back to the car and get home and get Russell in the warm and get him home as well. So, um, anyway, I shall write up a little tiny report at the bottom of the stream so you can all read it a bit later on. But uh, other than that, ciao ciao for now and I'll catch you some other time, probably soon. <laughs>